According to the Houston Press, TMZ, and many other news sources, a lot of drama went down last week at the Space City Comic Con in Houston. We don't know the full story, but we interviewed a group of people that went. Here's what they had to say. So you were at Space City Comic Con in Houston just recently. What date was that? May 27th through 29th? Yeah. Yeah. What days were you there? I was there just on a Saturday. Just on the Saturday? Mm -hmm. You were at Space City Comic Con what days? Uh, Saturday. So you were at Space City Comic Con last week? Yes. You've heard about all the controversy with the Sons of Anarchy cast and all that. I did hear about it. Um, it's supposedly started on Friday. The controversy did and just kind of trickled through the rest of the weekend. And from what I understand, it affected more than just the Sons of Anarchy celebrities. Um, I think the Hart twins were there. They posted something on there either Instagram or Facebook about it, they were not happy. They ended up not getting paid at all. So when I get upstairs, there's a long line, and I'm thinking, okay, well, this is the panel line, but so I'm just going to double check. So I kind of walked to the front of the line to make sure, and there were already mumblings, they're not going to do the panel today. They're not going to do the panel. Somebody walked by and said, they're not going to do it. They didn't do it yesterday. They're not going to do it today. Finally, someone came out, and said, we're getting the cast together. Um, as soon as we do, we get everything them set. We're going to start letting you in. Then I heard someone else say the reason they didn't have, I guess they were supposed to have had a panel the day before, said the microphones weren't working. So finally they let us in, and it was a nice setup, a big, huge video screen between two long tables. I mean, a nice production setup. Eventually, Ron Perlman comes out and they just start talking to him <laughs> and that's it and uh and he even made a joke about uh, about the big panel finally um about three other cast members eventually showed up none of the major players but still people you had recognized and that was it there was no explanation given and, and they were and it was a good panel i mean they were nice ron perlman was great he was very cordial he was taking people's questions and and everything and that was it so i know a lot of people were kind of scratching their heads wondering what was going on but you know it, whatever it is it was what it was did you notice any awkwardness go down uh, yes yes i did um well we me and my mother were trying to take a picture with ron perlman and Charlie Hunnam, of course. I, com I cosplayed as Charlie Hunnam. We finally got into the booth. Um, literally, we put our bags down. We were like the second or third person in line to get pictures with him. All of a sudden, he stopped everybody from coming and taking pictures with him and started whispering between him and the photo, the photo company that was troll of the place. Literally, seconds later after that, I, all I heard was, I'm done with this. I'm walking out until I get it. And that's all I heard. And it was super awkward. Ron Perlman was sitting there, like, not really knowing what's going on. The photo company just chased him out of the tent. And we're all just sitting there, like, what's going on? And he stormed back in, grabbed his bag, and he waved to us. He smiled. After that, we were just kind of sitting around. A whole bunch of other the stars that came in, uh, the guy who plays Bobby, and, uh, Tommy Flanagan, they came in, and all of them kind of had like this blank, what's going on kind of look on their face, and it was, it was a really interesting moment, but after about five minutes of waiting, they, they finally made it back in the booth to get the pictures with us. Oh, that's cool. So, other than that, you had a good time? Yeah, everything else was great. I got to meet all the people I wanted to meet, and everything else seemed to be pretty set up pretty well. Uh, we were at Space City on Saturday. Okay. Well, we actually, we purchased a photo op, um for Charlie Hunnam and Ron Perlman. But I was really excited because I was watching all the buzz about Ron Perl Perlman wanting to be Cable. So I had a t-shirt made. Yeah. It was cute. So you were in line to get pictures with Ron Perlman and Charlie Hunnam, and what went down? Um, well, we went in, you know, we, only wait, we didn't wait that long um, at all. And when we came in, um, there was just a bit of a ruckus. Uh, Charlie was talking to um, some gentleman, I don't know who, and left for a bit. Um, and then the studio, I guess, head or one of the employees told the uh, volunteers to come out and talk with them. I don't know why. Um, and then the whole cast came in. 
and they were all milling around and talking and um, Ron stayed in the room the whole time. We, we honestly don't know what went down, what happened, um, but Charlie was the one who came back in and reassured everybody. I mean, he actually came back in, he said, hey guys, no worries, just, you know, short break, you know, we'll be right back, thank you, you know, and, you know, cut out, and then, like, they were only gone for a couple minutes, and they came back in and, you know, redid the photos and stuff, and I thought our photo came out great. So. Yeah. Can you tell me about it? It was awesome. If, um, for my first Comic Con, if I could have picked one, this would have been it. Um, not a lot would get me to drive to Houston, and, and, but to see the Sons of Anarchy cast, that was pretty cool. So you're a big fan of Sons of Anarchy? Yes. And that was the main reason you are going? Yes. There was some drama. Um, I didn't know anything. It was just this fan heard this and this fan heard this and um, something about them not getting paid. But um, I was able to go and get all the pictures I wanted plus some. And, uh, you know, yes, I was like, would you hear, would you hear? But yet I was not able to see you know all the drama and the actors actually played it off really well like you couldn't tell that they were as mad as or what people said they were you couldn't tell that by the way they were acting the day that i was there i really didn't go into the dealer's room that much i was there in the dealer's room for maybe 30 45 minutes between uh photo shoots and the cosplay contest and while I was there, I was at booths for cosplayers and stuff like that, and I was geeking out over them, fangirling over Leon Shiro, uh, taking my phone and, and hugging me and just being generally sexy. So you had a good time? Yeah, I had a great time. Um, I always enjoy myself when it comes to photo shoots, especially when it's photo shoots at conventions because all my friends are there. That's... I, I can walk five feet through a con and see 20,000 people I know, you know? Yeah. So, there was a lot There was a lot of uh, squealing and high-pitched white <laughs> girl, Oh, 